Catch up. Catch up. To catch up means to talk with someone you have not seen for some time and find out what they have been doing. Cry. Cry. To cry means to produce tears from your eyes, often while making loud sounds because of pain, sorrow, or other strong emotions. Expensive. Expensive. Expensive means costing a lot of money. Famous. Famous. Famous means known or recognized by very many people. Friendly. Friendliest. Friendly means acting like a friend. Friendliest is the superlative adjective. Lucky. Luckiest. Lucky means having good luck. Luckiest is the superlative adjective. Messy. Messiest. Messy means not clean or tidy. Messiest is the superlative adjective. Nice. Nicest. Nice. Nice means kind, polite, and friendly. Nicest is the superlative adjective. Rent. Rent. Rent is money that you pay in return for being able to use property and especially to live in an apartment or house that belongs to someone else. Silly. Silliest. Silly means playful and funny. Silliest is the superlative adjective. Split. Split. To split means to divide something, such as money or food, among two or more people or things. T. T. T is a drink that is made by soaking the dried leaves of an Asian plant in hot water. Train. Train. A train is a group of vehicles that travel on a track and are connected to each other and usually to an engine. Turkey. Turkey. A turkey is a large American bird that is related to the chicken and that is hunted or raised by people for its meat. In lessons 30 and 31, you learned how to use the superlative form of adjectives. In this lesson, you hear Anna using superlative adjectives to tell Penelope about her friends and life in Washington, D.C. Jonathan and Ashley are two other good friends of mine. In the city, they are the friendliest people I know. They always help me when I need it. Notice that the spelling of some adjectives changes when we use the superlative form. For example, messy becomes messiest. When a two-syllable adjective ends in Y, we change the Y to an I-E-S-T 
to make the superlative. Notice that Anna uses the word the before nicest and messiest. Before superlative adjectives, we usually use the word the unless the adjective does not come before the noun. Now you try it. Answer this question with the superlative form. Are let's learn English lessons easy? Yes, they are the easiest English lessons. No, they are not the easiest English lessons. Sometimes superlative adjectives do not end in est. In this lesson, you hear Anna talking about Penelope. The superlative that Anna uses to describe Penelope is the most famous. I didn't forget. You are the most famous turkey farmer I know. The word famous has two syllables. With adjectives that are two or more syllables and do not end in y, we do not add est to make the superlative. Instead, we add the words the most before the adjective. For example, famous becomes the most famous. Now you try it. Answer this question with the superlative form. Are let's learn English lessons helpful? Yes, they are the most helpful English lessons. No, they are not the most helpful English lessons.